Hello, and welcome back to Knee TV. I'm Dr. Adam Rosen, an orthopedic surgeon who specializes in total knee replacements. Today, I'm going to speak to you briefly about what I call the giving way knee. This is a common complaint I hear from patients about their knee being unstable. Now, when patients present with an unstable knee, there are two ways to look at an unstable knee. From our standpoint, the doctor's standpoint, an unstable knee is truly a knee which has a ligament tear or rupture, and the knee truly is unstable in side-to-side -side motion when we test it. What I'm referring to here is commonly what patients refer to as instability, and that's the sense that the knee buckles or gives way. And this can happen at random times. This can happen walking down the street, getting out of a car, getting off the toilet. And that's what's confusing to them is they feel that there's something wrong. And Typically, this is due to arthritis and where a raw area of bone or a bruise in the bone may be touching another area and this causes pain. So the analogy that I like to use, which I think makes the most sense to patients, is imagine you're walking barefoot on the beach or across the floor. And if there was a broken seashell or a piece of glass or a tack on the floor and you were about to step on it, what happens within a split second before you ever realize what happens is that you almost stumble or potentially fall. Somebody may look at you and ask, what happened? What did you do? And what you'll realize at that point is that you almost stepped on something sharp. And the same sort of thing happens in your brain when you move or twist or bend your knee in a way where the arthritis and arthritic ends touch one another. So what's happened is your brain has realized that that sharp thing on the ground, that tack or piece of glass or seashell is really sharp and when you put weight on your heel or on your foot, your body sensed that. So before you shifted your entire weight and your muscle strength onto that leg, your body reflexively shuts off the muscle so you don't put full weight on the leg. And the same thing can happen to the knee when you have arthritis. What'll happen is bone A is sitting against bone B and as you bend it, some of those surfaces touch that pain goes right to your brain, your brain tells your muscle to shut off, and that gives you that sense of instability in your knee. Now, you can strengthen your muscles, and that may lessen the frequency. Some people have found that a brace is helpful. This isn't a ACL rupture where we have very specialized braces. This is what we call the sense of proprioception, meaning that there's a pressure sense on the skin around your knee, and that may make you more or less likely to have that knee buckle or give way. So it is something that you can try. There's very little downside in one of those neoprene knee sleeves, but it's not a guaranteed fix as the fix is inside your knee. One of the other things that may be safe for you if you find that this happens on a regular basis is to keep a cane or a walking stick handy for you, especially if you're out in public around people, walking out late at night, or walking on uneven surfaces. So I hope that that answers some of the questions or confusions that you might have about the unstable knee, or the knee that gives way. Thanks again for watching Knee TV. I'm Dr. Adam Rosen.